azospermia or a zero sperm count. This can be an extremely frustrating problem for the man. Most men expect that they're going to be able to get their wives pregnant in their bedroom, especially when they don't have any sexual dysfunction and their semen looks absolutely fine. But the reality is there is no correlation between sperm counts and sexual performance, which means when they do a semen test at the lab and then the report comes back as saying, hey, your sperm count is zero, you're shooting blanks, there are no sperms in the semen, that's a big blow. It's like their worst nightmare coming true and they don't know what to do next. And this used to be a huge problem, I would say 30 years ago, when we really didn't have very effective treatments for these men. The good news is we do have very effective treatment, which involves the process of IVFXC. Now you may wonder, hey, but if you're doing IVFXC, don't you require sperm in the semen? And the beauty is now the technology has become so good that even if there aren't any sperm in the semen, we can actually extract sperm either directly from the testis or from the epididymis and we can use these testicular and epididymal sperm to fertilize eggs in the IVF lab. This method for extracting sperm is called PISA or percutaneous epididymal sperm aspiration, no surgery is required or TISA or testicular epididymal sperm aspiration where again no surgery is required because we are actually extracting the sperm directly from the testis using a very very fine needle. We have videos about these techniques of TISA and PISA on our website at www.drmalpani.com. The good news is that in a good IVF clinic, the success rates with testicular and epididymal sperm for ICSI are very high because once these sperms have been extracted, the embryologist simply needs to put them inside the egg using the method for ICSI. And whether you use sperm for ICSI from the semen or from the testis or from the epididymis, makes absolutely no difference, which is very reassuring because a lot of these men with a zero sperm count have wives who are actually quite young because they make the diagnosis of their problem fairly easy. And because the wife is young, the success rates are very high. If you'd like to find out more, you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. I'm Dr. Malpani. I'm an IVF specialist. Our website is www.drmalpani.com. Happy to offer you a free second opinion. Thank you.